What are some of the common sports injuries that you see that reflect the upper body for women? So a lot of them, is, basically it's any sport with overhead use of the arms. So you're looking at swimming, uh, volleyball again, uh, softball uh, or baseball and sports like that. And softball, I know we have many injuries. Let's show our viewers a graphic because of that intense throwing, you know? Right. And I think, I don't know, maybe I'm wrong, but is it different for men than it is for women? It is basically softball versus baseball based on the pitching mechanics. And uh, the first three are usually due towards the, the specific style of underhand pitch we see in softball. So the forearm stress injury to throw a uh, fastball curveball with that underhand motion, it, it, it requires the uh, arm to flip over and pronate a bit, so kind of flip the arm so your palm is down, and that puts increased stress on the ulna, one of the bones in the forearm. That same motion requires uh, flexion of the biceps, but not uh, curling like you would normally imagine. It's just a tightening of the biceps as it actually stretches. So an eccentric contraction, which puts a lot of stress on the biceps tendon uh, and can cause pain and inflammation. The uh, third one list, ulnar neuritis, basically that wind up as the elbow comes by, it can hit the uh, hip of the patient. That constant compression of the medial aspect of the elbow can cause irritation uh, against the ulnar nerve, the funny bone area. Uh, you can get some pain at the medial elbow, but then some numbness on the fourth and fifth digit of the hand. And lastly, the UCL injury. This is one we see more in baseball or in fielders as they have the overhead throwing mechanism. And that, that one can cause pain and stress, again, on the uh, older collateral ligament on the medial aspect of the elbow.